for now. And we just made like a knee jerk reaction to go out there today. Right, apparently it's a must see. So we could not leave Guadalajara without going to the zoo. We must see, so you will see as well. Let's go to safari, y'all. <laughs> we guys, here. We made it to the zoo. Uh, we made it to the zoo. We made it to the zoo, hey. Uh, we out here, you guys. We did not plan on coming out here today, but I'm glad we did. It looks yes. like it's shaping up to be a beautiful sunny day. Yes. Um, when I went running this morning, it was raining. Uh, but look, today we brought our adventure hats. Mm -hmm. We're gonna have us an adventure. But if you did not bring your adventure hats, there are lots of vendors selling some for you to get. Right, beautiful little hats for you to pick up with these ladies out here. Um, but it's time for us to get up in here and have our little safari, aye? Right? You ready to go there, babe? Let's go. Let's go. Y'all, I can't tell you the last time I've been to a zoo. Uh, when's the last time you've been to a zoo? I honestly can't remember. So uh, it's been a grip. We about to hang out with some chimpanzees, do some roars with the lion. Hopefully I can uh, feed me a giraffe or two. Man, I'm looking forward to this. It's not quite right that I'm excited to go check out some animals at a zoo, but well, um, we're about to do it. So one of the reasons we're here is because this zoo is rated as like the top zoo in all of Latin America. So what's the deal like why is it rated like this why are so many people attracted to coming here mm -hmm. i don't know we're gonna figure it out well we're gonna put on our investigative hats today uh we're gonna pair them with our adventure hats and find out what the deal is you guys all right to start this adventure we needed to purchase our tickets now there are three different types of tickets you can purchase all varying by things that you are allowed access to in the zoo now inside the zoo you can pay for all of these things a la carte uh, but the three different tickets are Guadazu, Premier, and Diamante. Uh, we recommend that Premier ticket. The only difference between the Premier and Diamante is access to the Sky Zoo, which we don't think was worth the price of admission. We ready to get it, y'all. <laughs> all right, first recommendation, my people, is wear some shorts. Your boy wore all black, black jeans, black top with a leather hat. And I'm baking right now, y'all. I'm gonna be drenched by the time I walk out of here. But that's okay. All for the adventure, right? One good thing you should know is these signs are really easy to read. Everything is in Espanol, but they got the pictures, uh, the Pictionary for your boy. We're trying to find our way uh, to the Sky Zoo so we can ride around here before the sun really comes out to bake us. Uh, you may have missed that train already, though. Oh, they were going crazy a second ago. <laughs> so if you didn't pay, you can pay an additional 60 when you get over here, if you bought the basic pass. Shout out to all of our subs out there. If you see us, grab us so we can snap a photo. We appreciate you. And if you have not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. Oh, up, up, and away. She look like she's blind on somebody. Just chilling, enjoying the day. What's up, big boys? Hanging out in the shade. Man, I feel bad for them. Y'all see these empty chairs? The locals do not mess around with the Sky Zoo for very good cause. It goes along one track and returns on that same track, and you can't get off anywhere in between. But there is a little surprise at the end of track one. All right, you guys, my first little letdown. I thought we were gonna be able to get off over here, but it seems as if we simply turn around. This takes you right over to the edge of Barranca de Huertitan, which is a beautiful canyon to just behold, to explore, shoot videos in, fly your drone around in. This is just an awesome viewpoint right outside of Guadalajara and next to the zoo. All right, y'all, we are heading into the aquarium. Yes really excited about this part. I love seeing underwater sea creatures. I don't know what they have here. I mean, I saw a sign for a manatee, mm -hmm. but we'll see what else they have. 
Uh, look, little, little advice, man. Don't do the zoo alone. Yeah, I had to sound the alarm. I called my boy and asked him to bring his kids out here to show us around this zoo. And they're the experts, okay? They're Straight telling up. us, like, what we should see, what there is to see here. So we're just following their lead. So you don't need a guide. You just need some kids. Run that. <laughs> and to see a manatee, you see? Also known as a drake. This closely resembles the uh, rap star that you guys know as Drake. Yeah? Hello. Ah, you see the resemblance? Hello. Native of Canada, sir? Yeah? Uh, I don't know. So that was pretty cool. I mean, it's also been a minute since I've been to an aquarium and I didn't know that they had an aquarium portion to the zoo in Guadalajara, but it was really nice seeing all these different sorts of animals under the water and uh, just enjoying it. First of all, it's like cooler inside anyway, so if you need a break, go to the aquarium because it's cooler inside, but you're also going to see a lot of really cool fish, eels, stingray, and we're on our way to see the manatees now. You know, a little cross over here. You got it, baby? Did you get the shot? I got the shot. All right. I got the shot. We're excited about going in here because the kids have told us that it's cold and chilly, and I'm sweaty, so uh, we're about to go chill off with some penguins. <laughs> Water birds know how to partay. These penguins got down, man. It was just refreshing to see animals in a zoo that were happy. And these fellas right here were just bubbling. They were like ecstatic, especially when we pulled the cameras out. So we're going to go ahead and give this train ride a thumbs up and a firm Yarbrough recommendation, uh, if not for one reason. It covers a lot of area and this zoo is vast. Um, I don't think every exhibit is worth seeing and if you're on the train you can kind of identify the ones you want to see and circle back on foot. Also, if you have kids, you already know. The train ride comes uh, as part of the premier ticket package. So, yes, we believe it's worth it. You guys, it was so quiet when we got here, and I don't know monkeys to be that silent, so y'all know we had to go ahead and let them monkeys out. <laughs> yeah. Well, hello. <laughs> we started something, you guys. When we got them going, we still heard them hours later when we left the zoo. You have to share. <laughs> 
safari thing uh, we get to ride uh, in a little jeep as uh, we approach different animals and whatnot so kind of excited about this one Whew. but right now the penguins are winning penguins are winning everything oh the monkeys winning nah shoot i don't know them. those apes they got it yo i think the apes got it right now over there wondering that was dope that was nice uh, i think i saw an ostrich give birth to something that was not no bow movie <laughs> did you guys like the safari safari yeah you don't love your girl come on everybody let's, let's do it family come on i had to do one at a time it was bumpy and the funnest part was going inside the pinballs okay you like it because it was bumpy it felt a little dangerous yeah all right 
Excuse me. Did you, did Zoltan, did you like the safari? Yeah. What did you see? Alligator? Yeah. Crocodile? Yeah. What's the difference between an alligator and a crocodile? Crocodile is meaner. But also their snouts are different. Crocodile oh, has gracias. skinny, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And an alligator's is wider. Oh. Did you like the safari? I did, I did. I almost had deja vu, but it was really cool. Like the truck even went down into the water where you saw the hippos, but my favorite part was seeing the giraffes because one giraffe crossed in front of the truck. Like it was really it cool. They have a few of these like refueling stations, refreshment concession stands, so you can grab some french fries, a hot dog, some pizza, pizza ice cream. So we brought, we brought our snacks, so you can definitely buy a few things while you're here. I'm just really enjoying the, uh, the whole family vibe out here. You know what I'm saying? Everybody's with their kids, everybody's having a good time. I should say that. I've seen some single people out here just enjoying the animals. It's just a whole vibe unto itself. The zoo, the animals, uh, the beautiful day. It's just something to uh, behold. And we are. And I hope you guys caught the vibe when we're out here. Rondo? Rondo? Who said it? I heard you. Rondell? Rondell? Uh, are you tired? Yeah. Yeah. We are. All right, you guys. They wore us out today. We tap. I'm tapping out right now. Um, the zoo. We strongly, highly, severely recommend it. It's also good for a workout. There's lots of cardio involved. It's just a huge space with lots of animals and lots of walking. For real. My favorite was the safari. You guys have a favorite? Uh, What's your favorite? I like dancers with the birds. The birds? You okay. like the birds? Okay. But they kept saying nothing. Oh. <laughs> and I think, I don't you know, the safari. You did me not The safari was all that. What'd you say? What was your favorite? The rhino was disgusting. The rhino was nasty. Look, we just had a really good time hanging out at the zoo. Uh, this is a strong recommendation. The locals hang out here. When we were walking through here, we saw tons of locals. Uh, yeah, I think this we is are the only foreigners that we saw here. So people really do enjoy the zoo. That's what's up. So you would enjoy the zoo also. So if you get a chance to, come on down and check it out. Guadalajara Zoo. Yep. Boom. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, <laughs> give us a thumbs, thumbs up. up. And if you have not subscribed, hit that subscribe, subscribe button. button. Uh, my name is Rondell. My name is April. And we out here, y'all. Peace and love.